Along with the World Touring Car Championship, the Auto GP season started today, a championship that sees all drivers competing in the Lowlush chassis Zytec that pushes out 550 brake horsepower. From pole position, former GP3 driver Adrian Quave Hobbs of Great Britain held the early lead of the opening race of the year. The supernova driver got off to a great start whilst on the other side of the grid, Sergei Zirotkin stalled his car, luckily avoided the whole grid. The leading group remained in this order until lap four when Van der Drift lost control of his car into Parabolica, unable to avoid the gravel trap and rejoining in eighth. The mandatory pit stop didn't change the order at the front either. Craig Hobbs rejoined as the race leader and quickly extended his gap over Campana. The Italian was second across the line but was given a penalty, which dropped him down to tenth, pushing Vahaug up to second and Daniel de Jong into third. The early stages of race two were led by Max Snegdrev of Russia. After a solid start from second on the grid, Max passed Jakob Malriki and Christoph van der Drift to lead. This time around, though, the pit stops did have an effect on the outcome. Snegarev was amongst the first to pit, but then struggled on cold tyres. Whilst Ricky lost time during the tyre change itself, handing first and second place over to Paul Vahaug, number six, and then the drift. In an effort to make up for lost time, Campana's attempts to then overtake Ricky for third ended in disaster. Campana was a little ambitious with the late braking and the resulting collision ended the race for both drivers. Second winner of the day then was Paul Vauhau, the Norwegian driver, bringing the winner's trophy to his new team, Virtuosi UK, from seventh on the grid. It's done already. I know. I was like yesterday.